Uh, after working as a software engineer for more than two years, I developed interests in some specific areas such as distributed computing and machine learning. I soon realized that I need more knowledge and a more solid foundation in those areas to excel and uh, pursue them professionally. So that is why I applied to the MCS program. I think a lot of the projects in every class is what really makes this program quite valuable compared to like undergrad or maybe something else because they really help you build the knowledge of, hey, I'm giving you something. Own it, do what you will. And that's kind of the base of how it is in the workplace and how I've learned as well from my own work experience that a lot of times you're just given something with the bare minimum and you gotta do it. And at least here, they give you a little bit of extra help, but it's the same concept, which is actually in the field. Yeah, so uh, one thing that stands out to me uh, uh, during the program is the Keystone projects that we do over here. Um, I'm really grateful that I got an opportunity to work with SAP during our Keystone projects, which will uh, span over the next two quarters. So in, in this project, we got a chance to work with software engineers at SAP. We get, a, uh, we, uh, get the opportunity to go to their office, uh, network with software engineers over there, and get to learn how uh, projects actually are executed in the industry. Uh, so the cohort is very unique with people coming from very different backgrounds. Especially, they're not all from the tech industry. Some are experienced, some are fresh out of undergrad. So it's a very diverse cohort of people from different nationalities. Also, collaborating with them on different projects, such as the one we're having right now, that is Keystone, it's very important to get different point of views. So it forms a very strong basis for interesting conversations. So I've, my favorite one is still my algorithms class, just because in algorithms, I was able to kind of understand why you choose a different method of programming. And for me, the, my job as a software engineer, that's very important to know that there's different ways you can build something. But in terms of how do you want it in terms of complexity and stuff, that was very important to me. And then my data structures class kind of built on that algorithms class and understanding that you can analyze things in different ways because it's very difficult to analyze, which was apparent in algorithms. And slowly in terms of other classes, machine learning, artificial intelligence, all these concepts will build together. And that's what's important. So um, in the short term, I believe I want to learn uh, all the new different things that I can and uh, this program definitely helps me to do that because there are uh, do different courses in all the different domains that we have. There are courses on cybersecurity, operating systems, uh, cloud computing, etc., which I feel would be a great addition to me along with uh, the knowledge that I have to become a good software engineer in future. And also we have courses for projects and communications which will help me, I believe, uh, in the long term when I uh, go for the managerial positions and mentor other uh, junior developers in future. So apart from all the career services such as networking events and industry expos that the program has to offer, I still feel that the most valuable part is the education being given here. The professors are so good that you're actually drawn towards attending the classes. And it, it has happened with me personally that I've grown interest in a subject in which I didn't think I would ever like to venture into just because the professors were so good.